Hello, my name is Asad Zarimer. I'm going to show you how to make a water candle. I learned it some 50 years ago back home in Iran, and I'm going to show you how to do it. Although there is similar to this one, the technique is the same, but they have the right idea, but they don't have the right tools. I'm going to show you the right tools and the way the, you can make a water candle, which is beautiful. What we need is candle bar wax, candle coloring, and water. So what you need is a frame, this kind of frame. You gotta place a plate into the frame. In order to secure it, you have to fix it, secure it with the two clips so it won't fall. This is our handle because we have to merge this into the cold water. If we don't have this frame, we have to wear a long glove and do the job. We can make another way of handles. If it is not like this one, this is the metal. I bent it. You can put a plate here and screw it from in the middle. It got to fix to the frame. It can be loose. Now, we have already put the candle wax bar into the pot. It's melted. It's ready to use. This candle must be fixed to the center of the plate. Must be fixed, otherwise it will wobble because it is lighter than the water, it floats. So you gotta make sure that it's fixed. I made a hole in the, in the center of the plate, so I'm going to put, and there is a pin underneath, I'm going to insert it, and now our candle is almost steady, but not quite. What are we going to do is to put some wax around it. So with this scoop, we pour some wax, some wax into plate, and we insert it to the water like this. It's cold water, it sets quickly. I'm to going to insert more. So, you can do by pushing some wax around the base of the candle and makes it secure. This is the very hard part of the operation. Once it's secured, then you're on your way to go. I'm going to put it in the water again. So, it sets. Okay. We are done here. Now, important part. We can pour some coloring into the jar, not, not in the pot, of course, unless you want the whole candle the same color, and you stir it. Then, we take everything above the water and Pour it here. You see? And more like that. It stays like this. The cooler the water, the sooner it sets. Otherwise, you have to hold it for a long time. Here we go. You insert almost everything up to point that you want to change the color. Then 
pour some more. Pour some more. Some more. I'm going to add green coloring. This is usually is for decoration, not to burn it. There are lots of simple candles that you can burn them, but this is for decoration. I think it's worth to keep it. Thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. Thank you.